This project is about the community making changes to uh, their environment, changing the way our community uh, looks by in, uh, putting in rain gardens, urban gardens, and neighborhood gardens with uh, residential and agency input. What I do is I uh, recruit uh, residents and neighborhoods and organizations to work together to improve our neighborhood. I've been um, one of the one of the principal activists against the sewage plant. Probably for the first time, the county agreed to do a community restoration project. And so our group, along with Mercedes Bloodworth from Sun, we together created a process for the neighborhood to tell the county how they wanted it restored. It has been going on since like 2009. According to the government, they had to change the sewage. Uh, this is part of the, the sewage separation, rain garden, uh, the treatment plant, all of that, they, all of that has to do with sewage separation and then rebeautifying the neighborhood after they got done. Here, right here will help the neighborhood because it will bring, um, it's, it's an educational component to it where we have, we will be able to invite schools to come over and teach the young children about uh, the plants, the environment, and how to use our, our water more wisely. I think it beautifies the community and it also demonstrates what green infrastructure is. So this, this area will have a porous pavement sidewalk that goes um, diagonally through this land. It will have two rain gardens and a butterfly garden. It will have um, big trees soaking up the rain. So it's also a demonstration project.